Hi, and welcome to my YouTube channel, You Can Do More. My name is Jeff, and I've been Coach Floyd most of my adult life. This is the first in what will be a series of tutorial videos that I've produced and will, will be posting on this channel. The purpose of this channel is to help athletes, parents, and coaches understand and navigate the frankly confusing and often scary collegiate recruiting process. More importantly, the videos are designed to help increase the odds of you getting recruited, getting a scholarship offer, and being able to attend the college of your choice. So a little background. What makes me qualified to produce these videos and have this YouTube channel on recruiting? Well, as I mentioned, I've been a coach my whole life. I've coached a variety of sports in all levels, literally from Pop Warner to being a collegiate head football coach. Yeah, this is me a couple of years ago at U the University of Central Missouri. Well, okay, more than a couple of years ago. Most of the guys in this picture now have kids that are in college or getting ready to go into college. As a college coach, I recruited and signed athletes that were being recruited nationally. Athletes in Missouri, Texas, Florida, California, and were being recruited at all levels, from the FBS level down to NAIA. As a high school coach, I coached athletes that got recruited nationally, got, that got recruited for every level. So I know what it takes, and I know the process from that perspective also. And I was also a parent. My son got recruited to play football. He was, he was a football player in Texas and was recruited. So I've been on all sides of this. I've been at a collegiate coach doing the recruiting. I've been at a high school coach trying to get my athletes recruited. And I've been a parent who was involved in this process also. So I've been on every side of this issue, every side of this process. And I understand it. So who is this channel for? It's for athletes, parents, and coaches. And how do I know that this channel and these videos are really needed? Because from my experience, I know and understand that recruiting can be a scary, intimidating, mysterious process for most athletes and parents. And how do I know this? For one reason. On my blog, youcandomore.net, I have the ability to see what search terms brought people to land on my website. Every year, hundreds, thousands of people get there because they're asking questions regarding recruiting. Questions like, what should we ask the coach on a home visit? Do you know what a home visit is? What if I sign a letter of intent and get injured? What is a letter of intent? Do you know that? Do parents go on the college official campus visit? Do you know what constitutes an official visit and an unofficial visit, the difference between and how many you get? How many official visits can I take? What should I feed a college coach on a home visit? What is a home visit? A college coach is gonna come visit me at my house? How many freshman scholarships are given each year for each sport? And can the NCAA Division II school give a full scholarship? How can I tell if a school is really interested in me? These are just a few of the hundreds of questions I get about the recruiting process. So I know there's a lot of information that's not getting conveyed to, to students and parents. If you don't know and want to find out the answers to these questions, then this channel is for you. So is this strictly for football players that want to get recruited? No, this is for all sports. Now, most of my recruiting experience comes from the, foot, from the football side of things. And while the number and the calendar year may vary from sport to sport, the process is going to be pretty much the same. So information you're going to learn in these videos is going to help you regardless of what sport you're in. So when should I start thinking about this whole recruiting process? What, what grade should I be in? Well, if you're a senior, it is late in the process, but it's not too late. There's still information that's going to be included in, this, in these videos, in this channel, that will help you get recruited, that will help you get a scholarship offer. Really, the earlier the better. Eighth grade is not too early to start. Ninth grade year is pivotal, it's key, both athletically and academically in your high school year. So the sooner the better. If you're a senior, it's not too late. If you're an eighth grader, it's not too early. Now I've given this seminar, this presentation, in some of the top high schools in the country with hundreds of, hundreds of people in attendance. So how come I've decided on this format? Well, for a number of reasons. 
the first one, I can reach more people using this format. I'm not tied geographically to any one area, to just the Midwest. I can reach more people, my, I've expanded my reach. The second reason, I think this video format uh, lends itself to better understanding than just the written word. This information is on my blog. You can do more.net, contains the very same information that I'm presenting here. But I think the video format helps understanding. Number three, maybe the most important reason, this style, this format, allows for easy question and answer. Oftentimes in a large auditorium setting, students and parents can feel intimidated and be afraid to ask questions. It will be easy to ask questions in this format. All you need to do for each video is ask a question in the comment section. I will reply to all questions. That's my promise to you. Number four, this format allows for more bite-sized chunks. When I give the seminar, it's a four-hour seminar. Each of these videos are going to be eight to ten minutes long. So, allow, and it, so that will allow for easy digestion and digestion consumption at your own pace. If you want to binge and watch them all together, that's fine. That's up to you. If you want to take it easy and try to completely understand each segment, that might be the better way to go. And number five, in each one of the videos, I'll have links to supporting material. Websites that you can get to, NCAA sites, handouts, and, and uh, additional video. Now, let me be clear about this. This is not a recruiting service. In fact, it's the opposite. I'm telling you, don't, you don't need to use a recruiting service. The information that's going to be contained in these videos with what you can do, with what your parents can do, with the help from your high school coach, you can use that to get recruited and save yourself hundreds of dollars. Do not use a recruiting service. And lastly, I will not get you recruited. Your high school coach isn't going to get you recruited. Your AAU coach, your parents, they're not going to get you recruited. It's up to you to get recruited. What you do on the field, in the weight room, in the classroom, and marketing yourself through the use of these videos. That's what's going to get you recruited. That's what's going to help you get a scholarship offer. That's what's going to help you be able to attend the college of your choice. A final note, a few simple things that will really help me keep this channel going, that will allow me to continue providing information that will help you and your family in your recruiting process. Like I said, these are simple things. Just take a second. First, subscribe to the channel. Click on the button. Boom, you're in. You'll get all the information, all the videos in a timely manner. Second, like this video. Give it a thumbs up. That helps me more than you understand. Number three, leave a comment. If you've got a question about any of the information that I've presented, ask it in the comment section. If you just want to leave a comment, that's great too. Number four, I hope you take time to visit my Patreon page. There you can join Team You Can Do More and help me even further with this project I have. And lastly, Keep watching. Keep viewing. Next week's video, hey, this thing's not level. Tune in next week. Have a great week. See you.